responsible for the government of South Africa, <laughs> certainly. Um, maybe to put this in context a little bit, I think uh, LTE is something that is happening, but only happening in a few countries so far. So LTE is really happening in South Korea, in Japan, uh, in the US. Those are the three markets where really you have some uh, LTE coverage. Uh, and in particular, for example, South Korea being a relatively small country, it is where we have nationwide LTE coverage. Europe is not deploying LTE very fast for a number of reasons. Spectrum uh, allocation being late is one of them. Uh, the ability of operators to put the investment into the network once they've paid for the licenses being another one. Um, so we're not seeing huge and quick uh, LTE deployment throughout the world. So it's not like Africa or South Africa is the only country in the world without LTE. So uh, this being said, of course, you need Spectrum for this, uh, and, and Spectrum, uh, in, we're, we're clearly pushing for Spectrum not to be technology specific, uh, but to be technology neutral, and to be al al allocated to operators under license conditions uh, that will give them the ability to then deploy services. And there's two areas in which operators are trying to do that. One is more rural coverage, and the other one is more capacity to get to the mobile broadband, 3G and 4G. So that, that's, uh, I think, what needs to be left to them once they have the spectrum to do in the best way possible.